Hello future investors and welcome back to another weekly episode. Now have I got a massive episode for you regarding CBDCs and precious metals. It's crazy what's happening in the world right now and no one really knows about it apart from this small precious metals community. Now this is why you need to hear this because it is really going to affect precious metals. Now I recently watched one of my favorite YouTubers 365 Days of Silver and he covered a topic on CBDCs and uh, he linked a video in the description below which I will also link in the description below. Now it was Fox News reporting on CBDCs. Now I know what you're thinking Fox News not reliable. That's not the important factor here. The important factor is who they interviewed on the news. Now they interviewed Christine Lagarde. Now she is the president of of the European Central Bank. Now, you're not going to believe what she literally said, what came out of her mouth. She said in Europe right now, you will not be able to spend over £1,000 in cash or you may risk going to jail. Now, if you don't believe me, watch the video in the description below. It's only three minutes long, but when you finish this video, go and watch it if you don't believe me. She literally said, in Europe right now, we are limiting you to spending no more than £1,000 in cash. If you break those rules, you could face time in jail. Now, we know why they're doing this, don't we? It's to do with central banking digital currencies, otherwise known as CBDCs. Now, this is a huge thing and no one really knows about it. It's clear that the news has only just started picking up on this topic. But we in the precious metals community have known about this for a long time. Now, I've got to be honest myself, I really didn't expect this to be as prominent right now as it seems to be. I kept saying CBDCs are going to not come into fruition for a long time. But this is literally Christine Lagarde. She is the president of the European Central Bank. I need you to understand how massive this is. Not only is she the president of the Central Bank, the power she holds, but she has literally vocally come out and said, if you spend over £1,000 anywhere in Europe, you could potentially face time in jail. Now, you know what they're doing with this, don't you? They are already enforcing the controls of fiat currency to make you push into CBDCs as soon as they are released. They're going to make it as difficult as possible for you to enjoy and spend your cash because they don't want you to have that because cash is untraceable and untrackable and they want to know your spending habits, where you're spending your money, what time you're spending your money. They want to know all of the information because it is, in fact, all about control. Now, I know this sounds completely left wing, doesn't it? It sounds so crazy like the government is controlling us. Now, I'm not trying to get all, all crazy here. I'm literally just speaking the truth of what I've just seen. Now, what does this mean for precious metals? Well, as we know, when there's a crisis, people flock to precious metals. But this could really affect you buying certain precious metals in particular. Now, let me talk example for a one ounce gold Britannia coin. I've got one here. Let me get it so you can see it. Now, if you're buying something like fractional gold, maybe that's not a problem with cash because it's under £1,000 right now. But if you say someone who's maybe a little bit more fortunate and you've got over a £1,000 in cash, you, as of now, cannot go and buy one of these with cash because this costs you between sixteen pounds to £1,700 in pounds. So in dollars, you're looking at probably nearly $2,000. In euros, it's probably similar to, you know, £1,700, something like that. So if you were someone that buys precious metals with cash, you can no longer go and buy a precious metal like this with cash unless you do it in a private sale. But with private sales comes the risk of buying fraudulent gold. Now, that could be even more prevalent because people who make you know, fraudulent gold and precious metals bullion will know that people are going to be running towards spending as much of their money as possible in terms of their cash on this stuff before it really gets nailed down by the European Central Banking government that you cannot 
be buying anything of this weight with cash. So people are going to, in my opinion, start buying a lot right now. So that could potentially, if not definitely, increase gold prices dramatically. I think this is a really serious topic that should be covered and should be seriously taken into account. And if you think I'm exaggerating, I promise you I am not. Click the video after this video and watch it. It's in the description below. Or you can go and watch 365 Days of Silver video, which I've also linked in the video below. CBDCs is no laughing matter. I think it is something that we should be concerned about. And me, personally, I'm surprised that the... Uh, the president of the European Central Bank, Christine Lagarde, has come out and said this so vocally. Normally, you know, they release statements over time. They start feeding little bits into the public here and there. So no one has a panic buy or a panic sell. But for some reason, unlimited, unrestricted, she has just gone out there and said, literally, right now, we're going to be start to limit your amount you can spend in Central Europe or Europe at all at a thousand pound if you want to spend any more than a thousand pound she literally said you could spend time in jail i mean what is going on what is going on a thousand pound in the great scheme of things really isn't a lot of money there's plenty of people who spend that sort of money on a daily basis in cash so what are they going to do well i mean everything's going to have to be under the radar isn't it private sales and stuff like that because if you're trying to do it for an actual registered business they're not going to be willing to do that because they don't want to be done for fraud i mean it's a crazy topic isn't it so i know what i'm going to be doing right now i think there's a huge wave of pressure coming to the uh, fiat currency value and i think it's going to dramatically affect gold prices and if they're coming out as vocal as they are already suggesting comments like that I think gold and silver is going to have a huge spike. So I know what I'm going to be doing with my investing plan, but what are you going to be doing? So thanks very much for watching. This is an unedited this is an unedited video. It's completely raw as I wanted to jump straight on this topic and talk to you straight away because I think it's something that needs to be taught about and spoken about because if you're someone that wants to protect your wealth then this is a topic you should definitely know about. Thank you very much for watching. If you haven't already, please click that like button if you've stayed till the very end and leave a comment to let me know what you think on this topic because I would love to see that below. Until next time, I'll see you in the very next episode. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye, guys.